picture this. A musical maestro who, with a flick of his fingers, carved out the electrifying, soul-stirring sounds that defined an entire era. Jimmy Page's guitar prowess is the stuff of legends, and he's the man responsible for some of the most spine-tingling, heart-pounding riffs and solos ever to echo through the records of rock history. Led Zeppelin skyrocketed to fame, leaving an indelible mark on the world of music with their unique fusion of blues, hard rock, and folk influences. In today's video, let's get to know Jimmy Page of LED Zeppelin. But first, don't forget to hit like and subscribe to this YouTube channel to stay updated on the latest in the luxury world. At Luxury Mindset, we bring you all luxurious information ranging from items, cars, houses, places, and even people who bathe in luxury. Not only that, but we also give you pretty much the amount you would need to purchase any of this luxurious stuff. So if you are interested in the rich, becoming rich, or even dreaming of lying on a mattress of gold or dollar bills, click the notification bell to keep yourself updated on this channel. Jimmy Page is an English musician known for leading the rock band Led Zeppelin. He's famous for creating guitar riffs with unique tunings, melodic solos, and strong distorted tones. His style includes folk and Eastern-influenced acoustic work. Sometimes, he even plays the guitar with a cello bow to make a special sound. Now let's look at Jimmy Page's hobbies. He has a Labrador Retriever and usually keeps a low profile, not talking much about his personal life. Before Led Zeppelin, he played as a backup for Donovan's song, Purdy Gurdy Man. After Led Zeppelin, when split up, Jimmy Page played Stairway to Heaven as an instrumental, feeling that only Robert Plant could do justice to the song. His favorite color is blue, and he loves Indian food. He admires skilled musicians who approach their technique uniquely. How about Jimmy Page's relationships and family life? In 1970, he started dating French model Charlotte Martin, and they were together for over 10 years, having a daughter named Scarlett in 1971. In 1986, he married Patricia Ecker, and they had a son, James Patrick Page, in 1988. However, they divorced in 1995. During the No Quarter tour, Page met Ximena Gomez Paracha in Brazil, and they got married, having two children, Sofia Jade and Ashen Yosan, born in 1997 and 1999. Page also adopted Yana, Gomez Paracha's oldest daughter. Unfortunately, their marriage ended in divorce in 2008. Since 2014, Jimmy Page has been in a relationship with Scarlett Sabe, a talented poet and actress. How does Jimmy Page earn money? His guitar skills have not only brought him fame, but also a substantial fortune. As one of the wealthiest rock stars globally, he has earned mainly from his music career. In 1998, Page was ranked 15th among the world's richest rock stars. He made around $565,000 from the sales of his album The Firm in 1985 and about $572,000 from the album Outrider in 1988. In 1993, he earned $1.3 million from the album Coverdale and his 1998 album Walking into Clarksdale added $579,000 to his bank account. Apart from music, Page has also earned brand endorsements with famous brands like Fender and sponsored posts on Instagram. Jimmy Page's estimated net worth is around $180 million. With that net worth, there's no doubt he can afford any lifestyle he desires. In 1967, while still part of the Yardbirds, he bought Beat Tim's Boathouse in Pangbourne, Berkshire, where he lived until 1973. Later, in 1972, he purchased the Tower House in London, designed by William Burgess. Page also owned the Mill House in Windsor from 1980 to 2004 and Plumpton Place in Sussex, formerly owned by the owner of Country Life magazine, Edward Hudson. 
Interestingly, Plumpton Place was featured in the Led Zeppelin film The Song Remains the Same, where Paige is seen playing the hurdy-gurdy on the lawn. Nowadays, Paige resides in Deanery Garden, a house in Sunning Berkshire designed by Edwin Lutiens for Hudson. When he's not relaxing in his mansions, Jimmy Page drives around in several cars, including a 1936 Cord 810 Phaeton. A 1978 Ferrari 400 GT A Bentley MK6 A Ford. A Cadillac Escalade. and a 1966 Ferrari GTB 275. So what is his story to get where he is now? Born in 1944, Page's family moved to Feltham in 1952 and then to Epsom in Surrey. He attended Epsom County Pound Lane Primary School and later Ewell County Secondary School. He started playing guitar at the age of 12, was mostly self-taught and appeared on the All Your Own Talent Quest program at 13. Page left school at 15 to pursue a music career and started as a session guitarist in London. In 1965, he became a producer and A&R man at Immediate Records working with famous artists like John Mayall, Nico, and Clapton. In 1966, Jimmy Page joined the Yardbirds and later formed Led Zeppelin in 1968, quickly becoming one of the most iconic and influential rock bands. Led Zeppelin released successful albums, including Led Zeppelin II, Led Zeppelin III, Led Zeppelin IV, and Physical Graffiti. Page wrote much of Led Zeppelin's music and gained recognition as one of the greatest guitarists of his generation. Besides his work with Led Zeppelin, Jimmy Page has released multiple studio albums as a solo artist or in collaboration with other artists. Whether he's alone or with his band, he rocks. That's undeniable. So what are your favorite songs of Led Zeppelin? Let us know in the comments. And if you enjoyed this video, please click the notification bell to stay updated with the latest in the luxury world, only here at Luxury Mindset. See you in the next video.